Hey you guys, welcome back to Talk That Talk. Now today we have to talk about Megan Good and Devon Franklin. So Megan Good posted a picture with her now ex-husband and they basically announced that they are getting a divorce after much prayer and consideration they decided to go into their future separately but they're forever connected a lot of people were shocked that this happened because they have a book talking about you know relationships marriage and stuff like that and they just seemed like the perfect cute black couple okay so I know that they went through things during their marriage and that Megan received a lot of judgment from the church families. You know, a lot of people judged her, you know, her overall essence of being more sexy, how she dressed. And her husband, he went to bat for her and he supported her and he shut people down, you know, but she went through a lot of that. She even opened up about, you know, how they were kind of like opposites of what each other wanted. Like he didn't want somebody that was a smoker and um, she really wasn't open to having kids, but he wanted kids. And she realized that she was kind of changing, I guess, like her, her wants and things that she did in life was kind of changing as she was with him. And she wasn't saying that in like kind of like a bad way, but it seemed like, you know, they were kind of polar opposites of each other. So who knows if it would have, you know, ever really truly had worked out because they both seem to have wanted different things, but they were together for nine years. I'm really surprised they didn't have any children in those nine years. But Megan Good put up a post and she said, you brought me the highest life changing, affirming highs and the lowest gut wrenching, soul breaking lows. Although I'm grieving, I'm also in glorious awe and thankfulness to you, God. They say all endings are also beginnings. 2022, I'm choosing to be excited about what the beginning of this next act of life brings. Lord, I trust you. Now, on his page, he posted like a picture of him crying, more emotional and sad. And he said, I took this picture a few months ago. I'm not that much of a crier. So in a moment of deep pain and peace, I took this picture. It captures how best I feel. He wanted to share it with everybody and he's breaking his addiction to the new and working on being fully committed to what is true. So he wants true peace, true happiness, true friends and true love and all of that stuff. So a lot of people felt like, you know, he was doing the most by posting that and he was trying to get attention and stuff like that. And it kind of makes Megan look a little bad because like in her post, she's kind of looks peaceful then she has a picture where she's kind of happy and smiling granted i think she took that picture a long time ago but i don't think that picture is that crazy recent but it kind of makes him like look like he's the sad one crying and she's the one ready to move on so a lot of people were in the comments about his picture saying it's very strange and you know they're just not really here for it and you know divorce is hard people were trying not to laugh and and all that stuff like people just didn't understand why he was posting him crying and some people were saying you know i think it's okay for men to express their emotions and stuff like that so you know what i mean it was pretty much kind of like some people feeling it some people are not now also in relationships i have to talk about the whole situation with dr dre he is now ordered to pay his ex-wife nicole young a hundred million in divorce settlement This girl, Nicole, got to the bag, okay? So they officially settled their divorce. They had a very lengthy divorce settlement process. So according to TMZ, Dr. Dre will have to pay his ex-wife, Nicole, $100 million. And Dr. Dre, he's estimated to be worth about $820 million. So he's going to pay out the first $50 million now in the second half in a year. So yeah. That is a lot of freaking money, all right? So Dr. Dre is going to retain the ownership of the couple's real estate and keep rights to his music and stop, stock options, and um, including all of his sales and income from the, sale, from the sale of Beats by Dre because he sold that. Nicole's going to keep four vehicles, which is a Rolls Royce, a Cadillac Escalade, a motorcycle, and a Range Rover. And she's also going to um, keep her clo- pricey, expensive clothing, jewelry, bags, furs, which is worth millions, okay? 
So they are done, but she just got a hundred million dollars from Dr. Dre. She should be set for a while. All right. I am going to go, you guys. I hope you are having a great day. Comment down below what you think, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.